what is inside your heart, that's what shapes you. That's what you should be driven by. What are you passionate about? If you had to identify who you are as a person, just think about that real quick. And now think about the morals that you know, you've been raised with. Standing strong in, in what you believe in, that's what's gonna help you to overcome whatever tribulation that you face in life. And that's my message today is persevere to excel. So, you know, as you persevere in it, how do you excel? Well, you excel by cherishing those characteristics that you have, those attributes that you have. That's how you excel. Since I was born until 1997, lived a normal life in Africa, in Congo. Had cars, had money, had did this. My dad was very successful. In 1997, everything changed. A new government comes in. My dad is given an opportunity to, to work for the new government and all of a sudden he gets assassinated and everything my family have is taken away. And we don't know if we're gonna survive or if, if the government's gonna come and arrest us and kill us. We get an opportunity to move to a refugee camp. Live in a refugee camp for two, for two years. We get selected to move to the States in 2000. Whoa, a dream came true. Boom, we're here. Now learning how to acclimate to the new life. It's like, oh my goodness, what's going on? Single mother, four kids, learning how to cope with everything. I'm stuck with bitterness and anger in my heart, 10 years old, not knowing how to cope with it. I began to volunteer my time, giving up my summer in order to serve people, fostering the gifts and talent and the things that I was passionate about in order for me to continue to move forward. Now the table's turned. Now look into your own life. How are you gonna stand strong when different stuff happens with your life? What are you, what are you motivated by? Like, what gets you going? Like, what are you, like, what are you like, passionate about? Cherishing in that. If you, when you cherish that, I'm telling you, nothing can push, like nothing can, can break you apart because you're strong with who you are as a person. But if the only thing you can come out of after you live here is that, how can I cherish who I am as a person in order for one, to overcome the challenges that I face, two, to continue to move on from it and also cherish the stuff that I'm passionate about. So that's just a little encouragement to you guys that to cherish what you got, to cherish some of the stuff that you like to do, because you never know where it's going to take you. So give me a beat, and I want to I wanna dance to them real quick. Right? You guys want to see me dance? Yeah! Clap. Dale's going to need to feel that energy. Can I hear some screams in here? Come on. A little bit louder than that. Can I hear it, maybe? Maybe. Right side. Uh. Go Shack. Go Shack. Show Shack. Uh. Get him. Get him. Up. Come up on stage. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come up. Come up. Hey. Step and kick, step and kick, turn, jump, jump, turn, rush, rush, pull. And now you guys gotta do it by yourself, without me, without me, without me, ready? Five, six, five, six, seven, eight, step and kick, step and kick, turn, jump, jump, turn, rush, rush, ha! Freestyle here. This is how we're gonna end it. We're gonna do a little freestyle battle. Oh! Teachers, next round. Woo! All right, we're gonna get a teacher. A teacher. Give it up for your classmates. Good job, good job, good job, good job, good job. Cherish who you are as a person, 
And whenever you face difficulties, you can definitely overcome them and you continue to move forward. Thank you so much. One more time for Teo Moano and the movement from above. Thank you.